Hi, I'm Rob Newton, and this is Fire Station 44, our newest emergency response facility south of 466A. As we venture into a new area and our final phase of construction south of 466A, we are so excited for the residents. And now for a tour of the state-of-the-art facility, here's Fire Chief Mike Tucker. Thanks, Rob. The last time you were here, the station was under construction, and there wasn't a whole lot to see. But as you can tell, that's different now. We have our emergency response apparatus in place, and the reality is that most people recognize fire stations because of the bay and the equipment that's in it. But this isn't a normal bay. In addition to the emergency response apparatus and the equipment in here, this area is also a high-level high training facility. Above us is a training platform where the firefighters can actually practice a lot of their advancing hose lines, high angle rescues, and rope rescues. It's pretty unique for a facility to have something like this in it. In each of the stations, we have fire suppression apparatus. Currently in the inventory, we have five fire engines, one aerial platform, which is 95 feet in length. The department responds to more than 11,000 calls annually. We also have a cardiac arrest save rate that is 43% which is six times the national average. Needless to say, we're pretty proud of the operations and the capabilities of the department as we serve the village's residents and those surrounding the area as well. We're currently standing in the foyer of our emergency operations center. This building is intended to be used during disaster response. The reality though is that this part of the building is a multi-purpose facility as well. We also use it for training the firefighters on a regular basis on the continuing education that they require to keep their paramedic and emergency medical technician skills up to date and current. We're currently standing in the kitchen of the new station. The kitchen is the lifeblood of the department. The reality is the firefighters live here 24 hours a day. It's a home away from home. They spend one third of their lives here as they're on duty for 24 hours. The department currently has 84 firefighters assigned to the various stations operating on three ships. In addition to the kitchen, the firefighters home away from home does feature a day room, a sleeping area, and a fitness room as well. We build fitness rooms and use fitness equipment to try to keep the firefighters safe and healthy. Unfortunately, many firefighters suffer from cardiac related diseases and it's our goal to keep them physically fit, which proves beneficial to the residents of the community that we serve. I hope you've enjoyed your tour and visit to the latest fire station for the Village's Public Safety Department. As you can tell, we're pretty excited about the great facility and the exciting location. We believe that it's gonna serve the residents of this area tremendously. Thanks, Mike, that was great, great information. Now folks, stay tuned to V-Mail each and every month for more construction updates.